This two minute tutorial is the final entry in our series all about holds. Today we will be looking at how to group holds. Grouping holds allows staff to be able to group multiple holds together if just one of those holds is needed to satisfy a request. Once the hold is fulfilled, the other requests in the group are automatically deleted. In this example, the patron is interested in watching the movie The Force Awakens. It does not matter if the request is satisfied by a DVD or by a Blu-ray, the patron is interested in whatever format is available the fastest. To create a group, place holds on the eligible titles. Select the holds you wish to group together. Use the More drop-down menu and select Add to Group. The hold requests are now grouped together and a letter is assigned to identify which group the requests belong to. As soon as an eligible item is trapped for the patron, the other holds in the group will disappear. A patron may have as many hold groups on their account as needed. To remove a single title from a grouping, select the title and under the More drop-down menu, select Remove from Group. To remove multiple titles or to remove the group altogether, select All Relevant Titles and under the More drop-down menu, select Remove from Group. A title may be added to an existing group. Select the title you wish to add, plus select one title already assigned to the group. Use the More drop-down menu and select Add to Group. The title will be added to the selected group. This has been a two-minute tutorial on grouping holds. If you have any questions, please email help at ccslib.org.